James Kaufman, World News Report today. Today's October 23rd, 2022, 7.30 p.m. Central here in the USA. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world, folks. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. Well, they came up with another one. We have another rock inbound. It's going to come awful close to earth here. This is 2022 UC7. All right, they are saying that this rock, 2022 UC7, will actually come much closer to the moon than it does Earth. They're giving it a 0.9 lunar distance clearance from the center of, well, the core of the Earth here. You can see the inner solar system ending with Mars. As we back out, it's a near-Earth object, another one. It moves in and out of the inner solar system. Then you can see Jupiter, Saturn, and this is kind of the scale, but not quite. Again, the inner solar system is considered to be Mars, Earth, Mercury, and Venus. And this is a near-Earth object just actually announced today. There's a lot of good news about this. The good news is uh, that it's just over 30 feet in diameter. The bad news, obviously, is it's coming awful close to Earth, and it's moving at 10 kilometers per second, which is around, well, 22,000 miles an hour. And it's coming in at an angle, not coming up slowly behind Earth in its orbit. Angular impacts are always more substantial. So as you can see by the solution date, October 23rd, 2022, that is today, data arc span one day. They're giving us just a, a, a few moments notice. Tomorrow is the 24th, right? So a little over 24 hours notice. Again, a problem I have, condition code 7, 0 being they know where it's going, 9 being that they're highly uncertain to where it's going. This is only caught by automatic or AI software. No human would catch anything. Data arc span, one day. Observations, 30. So it is coming in at an angle. We'll see what happens. It could actually hit the moon. But again, I did say estimates are around 30 plus feet in diameter, although with a condition code of 7, they hardly know how large it is. And before we go, we're going to actually have to take an impact here. I thought we were impacting very soon. It's like tomorrow's the day, so let's hit it. Boom! All right. It says still 367,000 kilometers. The moon's about 230,000 miles. Those must be fairly equivalent numbers. Uh, however, I'm not quite sure what time of day. You can step this down to minutes, days, hours. Tomorrow's the big day with the... Well, we'll take a look at that impact there, or close to impact. There it is there for you guys to really take a look at. And we'll move it out. So you can see the two coming together, 2022 UCF and Earth. There's a considerable, uh, well, angle, but it does not look like they do impact. It does look like they do cross each other's orbital paths. God bless you and yours. Please share, subscribe. Always remember that anything is possible in the bizarre world.